get ready to take a short break from Cat Dog. Starting now. They're short. They're powerful. They're thumbs. Nicktoons Network presents Thumbs, the first thumb wrestling spectacular ever captured on television. It's three and a half minutes every hour of the most hard-hitting, bone-crushing action you've ever seen between two masked digits. While other networks are giving you the finger, we'll be giving you the thumbs. At the top of every hour, starting Monday night at 7, only on Nicktoons Network. Things will get out of hand. Look, it's SpongeBob SquarePants hanging with his crew. Looks like you got that sandy cheeks into trouble, SpongeBob. And why is Patrick all smashed up? Where are Gary's pants, SpongeBob? Where are Gary's pants? SpongeBob SquarePants, lovable water absorber or twisted square panted menace? You decide. Nathan's Network. A brand new way to see your favorite Nicktoons hits and premieres. Meet Laura. So you can eat your crust? Is that a yes? She has an unnatural obsession with Jimmy Neutron. Ah! Good boy. Let it all out. Oh, watch the shoes. Yeah, she's one of us. Nicktoons Network. We love what you love. Ugh. No more pepperoni for you. Cat dog will be back on your TV so fast your head'll spin. Or maybe it'll just shake a little. Cat dog. Cat dog. Cat dog. Cat dog. Alone in the world. And the Fairly Odds are going head to head to head for the best animated series of the Kids' Choice Awards. Really? Watch the talented nominees do what they do best in a three-hour marathon, starting tomorrow at 10 a.m., only on Nicktoons Network. <laughs> If it isn't the Fairly Odd Parents, good old Cosmo, simple Cosmo. Is Cosmo really this stupid? Or is he actually so brilliant that he's aiming to take down little Timmy Turner? Cosmo, magical family member or maniacal genius? You decide. Nicktoons Network, a brand new way to see your favorite Nicktoons hits and premieres. Presents Hi Earthlings, I'm Larry. This is my sister Loopy, and this is the moon. Now, thanks to modern science, we've got the moon pretty much figured out these days. But try telling that to Loopy. Looks like a giant moldy crab apple. Hey kids, have you seen the man on the moon yet? <laughs> Come on, Dad. Everyone knows the man in the moon is just shadows on the surface. Shadows? Yeah, I see them too. That one's a dinosaur, and there's a giant bird. Oh, brother. I saw him. I'll prove it to you. Loopy, you can't lasso the moon. It's 250,000 miles away. You're right. I'm gonna need a longer clothesline. That night, I was in the middle of the coolest dream about the Charlie Chicken Show. <laughs> when suddenly... Hey! Grab your moon shoes, Space Cowboy! I got a surprise for you. Well, I had no idea how modern science was gonna explain all this. But I figured I'd worry about it later. Hey, let's go find the man on the moon. 
Loopy, there isn't any man in the moon. I told you, it's just... Shadows? Ah, ah. It came from over here! Ah. Grab onto the solar shield, Lunasaurus! Space Eagle, I can't hold on any longer. Destabilize the anti-gravitational field! See? I told you I saw the man in the moon. Hold on, Lunasaurus! So they finally decided to send a rescue party. Gee, thanks. You know, I've been stranded here since the 70s. Can you believe those jerks took off without me? I tell you, I would have gone totally Sputnik if it wasn't for these two guys. Ah, ah. What are you two staring at? Come on, let's get off this moldy crab apple. Good written. See you, kids. I'm off to kick some NASA hiding. So I guess Loopy proved we're never going to solve all the mysteries of the moon. In fact, Dad's working on one right now. Hey, anyone seen my polka-dotted underwear? <laughs>